those kind of guys. Tyler Hansborough was the best college player. But, like, Ty Lawson was the fastest was, human I've ever seen with a ball in his hands. Was Hansborough – okay, so rank Tyler Hansborough among ACC players of – since you started following it. Like, give me your, give me your top three – Maybe a, a, of since you started following ACC basketball, can you do that? Or top that would five? be hard. Like like Kenny's up there. Kenny uh, Kenny Anderson's up there. Yeah. Right. Like Kenny Anderson's. There. I, I'll think about schools and I'll go. Um, you played against Kenny Anderson. I I, I we used to joke. He's, yeah, listen, he's older than I thought he was. I would I, we would joke and I would say, <laughs> I'm the reason Kenny went pro. Because we played them my freshman year, and it was like, woo. Um, <laughs> he, was a, he was a wizard. I mean, that team, too. Their oh, guards. Oh, yeah. Him and B.O., Brian Oliver, were, 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 were problems. Uh, Dennis had just left when I got there. Um, people won't understand how good Sam Cassell was. And him and Bob Sarah Sarah? was then. Yeah, him and Bob Sarah Bob was Sarah there. get up. Um, State had fire and ice. Um, Carolina point guards were a little bit different then because they had more your traditional big defensive guys like Phelps was would never yeah. be historic, but he was a winner, competitive guy. King Rice was yeah. a senior when I was a freshman. It was a problem. Um, Duke was always from Cape yeah. to like Grant. <laughs> yeah. But it's hard to argue the success of Lakner. And, and when we came in, like they were the national champions. Duke was back-to-back, and then – Carolina was right, right following those guys in '93. So, um, it's hard to. I would really, I would give it disservice doing it, but it's hard to argue with a guy like Grant the success that he had. I mean, the Final Four runs. He had. I mean, he's when he finishes and what he did with, with from being a role guy to being a guy, essentially, two back-to-back national championships, Final Four runs. So, I would say, college for all of my years playing, I, I, I think. It's hard to argue against success and how good. I don't think people really know how good Grant Hill was. Or awesome. I, both of you, I could have listened to this. That's just great perspective. Awesome. I was going to ask him, since we're at the ACC, turn, uh, ACC Media Day here, yep. what? give me your, your greatest memory, both of you guys, of being in the ACC. I, I think I know yours, but you can pick anything. No. <laughs> it, it, my, my greatest personal memory was, again, was my senior night getting my jersey they retired my jersey as senior night like that's that's, that's not awesome. something that that's happens right. a lot that right like they usually never happens. You, that's my point that's so exceptional that that is that's th- cool that's yeah. the thing that stands out to me more than anything that's ever happened and more, was was having your jersey retired senior night Man. and and I'll add I think Les Robinson was the coach at NC State they go win they come back out and they sit on the bench and watch my ceremony really no way I, I, because it, that was that's when you – that was classy. the first time where I felt like, damn, I must have been pretty good yeah. because that's a hell of a compliment and respect to come out and say, watch they this. They really did. They, they did that. Les Robinson did. It came out watched that. Wow. 14-5. That was the greatest memory for me of being a part of that. Uh, if I had to say that's watching incredible. something like that. Um, Fanti, you should have started with me. It was watching the Duke guys. <laughs> you don't watching that? the Duke natties. You don't want to follow that? Watching the Duke natties. <laughs> 